So chances are you've heard about HubSpot. You might even have downloaded a resource from their website, but you're not exactly sure what HubSpot actually is. And it's a common confusion point, not only because HubSpot is such a powerful suite of a number of different tools, but also there's a lot of fluff and I guess hype online about what it actually does. The best way to look at HubSpot is that it does three key things really, really well. Firstly, it automates marketing activity based on user-triggered behavior. Now, by that I mean, when I say marketing activity, it could be an automated email, it could be an automated SMS, it could be the creation of a task that is sent to your internal team or sales team for them to action. So, as an example, say you have a prospect who's gone cold, who's gone missing for three months, and all of a sudden, they come back to your website. You could send them an automated email that is sent on behalf of a sales rep, sending them a well-timed offer and perhaps the opportunity to book a meeting, all automatically, even if that sales rep is off sick. Or for example, say you're a college and you've got closing dates for a number of different courses. You could send an automated SMS to these prospects, advising them that positions are closing and limited spots remain, for example. The second thing HubSpot does really, really well is that it bubbles your warmest leads to the top. So, say I visit your website and I fill out a contact form, and that's all I do. But prospect B does the exact same thing, they fill out a form. But they also open up your autoresponder email three times, they visit your pricing page four or five times, they check out who you are, your address. Now arguably that person is a lot warmer and closer to making a decision than I would be. Your sales reps should be advised of that. This should actually help them focus on the most warmest leads first. Thirdly, HubSpot combines a lot of different sales and marketing tools all in one place. A lot of these you'll be familiar with, but the beauty is you have a single customer view or a single database where all of these tools can, I guess, leverage off and take advantage of. So for example, HubSpot has an email platform in it. Think of MailChimp on steroids. HubSpot has a landing page and form builder in it. HubSpot has a blogging platform inside of it. You can also manage all of your social media from it and from one place, post your content from your blog to Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and Twitter. So like anything, HubSpot requires, HubSpot is the machine, right? If HubSpot is the Ferrari, your content and inbound marketing efforts are going to be your fuel. Those two things have to work together. So hopefully this video helped and now you know a little bit more about what HubSpot actually is.